da da do 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 Hey, Instagram, it's me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet. You know, when I came to South Africa about, well, 21 years ago, uh, it was interesting because, uh, uh, you know, Madiba was, a, well, uh, Nelson Mandela was president. He was like a rock star, you know. Now he had speeches, and people could actually recite, recite his speeches. He's a celebrity, you know, and everybody wanted to be next to Nelson Mandela, you know. Also at the time, the only names I heard was uh, was uh, Jacob Zuma and uh, Helen Zilla and the Juju, uh, um, uh, Jewish Malema. And they were like, well, stars, you know, <laughs> like that. Now, fast forward, these days, you know, well, Madiba is gone, you know, peace and blessings upon his eternal soul. Uh, and there are no real stars, but no, but when you think about it, actually, um, uh, Ju uh, well, Jewish Malema is, uh, is a star, you know, head of the EFF, he started the EFF, back then he was in the uh, ANC Youth League, Youth League. and uh, 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 what's the name, uh, you know, uh, uh, the guy, the myth, the man, the myth, the myth, the left, um, he was, the, the, the Cat Cat was, the, 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 well, I guess he would be one, two, three, actually he was the, the third president of uh, South Africa, uh, was, uh, well, he was a household name, you know, because you could say his name was Zuma, 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 Zuma. And when you repeat these names, people become stars, and that's what it is. Well, recently, uh, when I was uh, looking at things, let's put it that way, uh, in this recent election, what people uh, realized that, well, they, they tried to get celebrities. In fact, you know, back then, uh, Jay-Z and Beyonce, they were stars too, and to this day, they kept on being stars. They kept his name, they kept their name up. But their star power, uh, like what happened in the U.S. elections, just past the U.S. elections, this is a Tuesday, by the way, so it's a, it's a U.S.-centered kind of day. You know, it's, it's, a, it's a tea tirade, welcome in. It's a U.S. kind of, uh, a centered kind of day. Tomorrow is a, it's a world, world-centered world kind of day, or Thursday is a audio drama day. Friday is a wrap-up of the week, uh, things that I you know, want to put together. Uh, Saturday is like whatever happens in my head. Sunday is like I usually read something and then riff off that. And then Monday is a me day. But this is Tuesday, which is a, um, a U.S.-centered day, usually around politics, but it could be anything. But I'm bringing this up and, and linking this uh, South Africa and uh, U.S. politics like that. Because what people realized this last election is that celebrities no longer have the power they have. But the true celebrity, the true celebrity is uh, Donald Trump. He's a celebrity, you know. People just keep on. That, 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 they, 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 he's got groupies, you know. But what happened recently? Uh, uh, Zuma launched this MK party, and uh, and he's got groupies, you know. He really had some function, and all the press was running around behind him just like a groupie, you know. They just adore th this guy, you know. And the MK party, you know, uh, I just I'll talk about them another time, but uh, because it's about U.S. Century Day. But what I want to say about the celebrity thing is that. What I learned in the past year, there's, uh, you know, you have those uh, uh, analysis like the, the, the Marxists, you know, the, or I should say the Engels analysis. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, you, you'll get the inside joke if you can. You know, socialism and everybody's talking about, you know, there's a class, there's a, the, the, the middle class and a, a whatever class and, the, and the whatever it deep, deep, deep. But I learned some that's the last two years, I learned there's two other classes that nobody talks about these days. The two classes are a language class. The, the people who speak English is the number one language in the world as far as you know, if you're airplane pilot it's English whatever that's computer language is English so that's a that's a that's a, a class right the other class and is a is a celebrity class a celebrity class so there's two additional classes that's not uh, that's not covered by Ingles because back then no you get you gotta hey folks you gotta update your stuff you know <laughs> so so those two classes now. What happens with Zuma, he's of now, he, well, he's of the, well, he speaks English, but he's, he's of that celebrity class. Donald Trump speaks English, but he's of that celebrity class. And what's interesting is because the reason why the media was running behind Zuma, like the media runs behind, behind uh, uh, Trump, uh, uh, is that, you know, well, they're of the celebrity class. They're biggest celebrities. That's like with Diva back there was bigger celebrities than any celebrity on the planet. You see? And so... 
what's with the fear now is not the fear now. With, with, at least with the media, with the powers that be, is that you know uh, Trump only got what, three or four years, and then when he goes, uh, they they're not going to have any a uh, superstar like that, like like a Madiba superstar. Uh, and Zuma, when Zuma, uh, you know, his MK party is happening now, but they still got him to you know maybe the last four years because they guess in five years they'll have a have an election or whatever it is. But he he's back on the scene. But the point is, right. When he goes, they'll be, you know, what are the what's the media going to do? How are they going to make their money? You, you understand where I'm going with this? My, my thing is basically that uh, don't discount the celebrity class, but you can't discount them because celebrity is a fleeting thing. It only happens to a few people. If you have a super celebrity, then boom, 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 boom. Oh, by the way, just as a footnote, I used to say long before when Donald Trump was coming up, I said, you know, I'm, I'm in South Africa. I've been in South Africa, like I said, for 21 years. And I said, what are, they, what are they talking about? Zuma is the original Trump. If you really look at all the stuff that Zuma and Trump, this parallel, separated, I won't say separated, but parallel courses, let's put it that way, you know? And, and sure enough, that's what it's all about, you see? So uh, I would say this, right? Enjoy celebrity while you can, but the rest of us, man, you get, 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 get off that celebrity tip. You know, stop reacting. Well. I can't tell you what to do because you're going to do what you're going to do because everybody loves celebrity in the celebrity class. But like this last election, you realize celebrity is a fleeting thing. And people are, you know, and so, well, celebrity don't mean nothing if you have a bigger celebrity than, than the celebrity, right? Than authentic celebrities, let's put it that way. Okay, so I just thought I'd lay that on you for, you know, why? Because, well, because that's what I do. <laughs> Check you all later. Be well. Da 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 da